This is artifacts. Apparently, mainstream media didn't think it important to uh, tell us about this story. I just learned about it. I was doing some poking around the internet. Somehow, I managed to morph from this to solving solving a problem on Second Life that I was having. Anyway, California schools are no able no longer be allowed to use Redskins as a nickname for the sports teams under legislation signed by the Marxist governor, Jerry Brown. The bill, signed by Governor Jerry Brown Sunday, will prevent the state schools from using a term which many American Indians believe to be offensive beginning in 2017. That is bullshit. I'm a Native American. I'm a Native because I was born here. Screw you people. Yeah, I'm an angry white male. I don't have a drop of Indian blood in me, but I'm a Native American because I was born here, so screw you people. I was born here, I didn't get a choice in that. Democratic Assembly in Luis Alejo of Watsonville told the Associated Press name dates from period in California history when bounty hunters were rewarded for slaying Native Americans and should not be dignified with school affiliations. That is incredible bullshit. Well, that's grossly an error because let's take a look at this article here for a second. According to this article on Slate, it was actually Native uh, American Indians. Right? originally came up with this name uh, Redskin. It just got into the lexicon. But of course it's being names being banned and the team is being harassed. I heard some story, I haven't been able to find it. That uh, some feds are putting together a party and Redskins are not allowed there. Redskins as in Redskin jer uh, jerseys and hell and so forth. I don't know if that's true, how much is true and how much is BS, but anyway. Well, there you have it. Uh, there's a whole bunch of history on here, and I'm not going to read it all. We get back to the original article. Only one of four schools in California still have team teams or mascots called the Redskins. Federal panel ruled last year that teams trademark for NFL Washington Redskins should be canceled, but the team is challenging the decision. I would hope so. The Oneidas Indian Nation representative Ray Halbreder and National Congress of American Indians Executive Director Jackie Page released a statement attempting to use the California law to pressure the NFL's Redskins to change their name. Screw you. The landmark legislation limiting the R word in California schools clearly demonstrates that this issue is not going in the way in opposition to the Washington team on this issue is only intensifying. The NFL should activate, act immediately to press the team change its name, same as Red in part. Brown rejected separate legislation on Sunday that bans naming parks, schools, and other public property after Confederate leaders. I'm a little surprised that he didn't sign that, too. More than a little surprised. See, this is about control. These people love to ingratiate themselves with different groups, so what they do is they say, we're doing this stuff to honor you, when in fact what they're doing is they're attacking our freedom. So, screw them. That's the way I see it. 
Uh, if you Californians are smart, you would get rid of this idiot. He doesn't belong in there. He's a leftist pinko commie. Unbelievable. Like I said, this is uh, dated October 12th. So it's a little old. I never... I didn't hear of it until today. I didn't hear about it until today, but, uh... I decided to use it for an update. This is ridiculous. It's absurd. Liberalism is a mental disorder. It's American Indians that thought up this name, so... I don't know where this country go is going other than straight downhill. Liberalism is a mental disorder. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.